we have to find the mass of the lamina over the region r and the region r is bounded between these two curve so this is the region r so we have to perform the integration over this region so let's say we will first integrate with respect to y and second we will integrate with respect to x since first we are integrating with respect to y we will consider strip parallel to y axis so now remember only the formula of mass is going to change the procedure remains the same as we used to solve in area problems okay so we will consider one strip parallel to y axis so this is the strip parallel to y axis because we have to cover this entire area so the lower end of the strip is on the parabola so parabola will be y equal to x square minus 3x and the upper end of the strip is on the line and the equation of line is y equal to 2x so these are the lower and the upper limit of the y we have to cover this entire region so we will move this strip from this point towards right hand side till this point that means x is going from this point till this point at this point x is 5 which is the upper limit at this point x is 0 which is the lower limit so this 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 and this are the limits of this region r so we get mass equal to x is going from 0 to 5 y is going from x square minus 3x to y equal to 2x and rho dx dy what is rho rho is given as gamma of lambda of x into y so we we can write rho as so we can write rho as lambda of x into y dx dy so first we are integrating with respect to y so this lambda into x is cons is constant when we are integrating with respect to y so they can be taken out of the integration and the lambda is already a constant so it can taken out of the integration of x also so we have x going from 0 to 5 and y is going from x square minus 3x to 2x and y here we will write x dy dx just concentrate on this integration so here we have integration of y what is integration of y it is nothing but y square upon 2 so we have lambda upon 2 i am taking 2 outside integration of x is going from 0 to 5 and here we apply the lower limit of y that is x square minus 3x and upper limit that is 2x into dx so we get lambda upon 2 x is going from 0 to 5 x here we will have the upper limit minus the lower limit into dx when we put y equal to 2x here we will get 4 x square when we put y equal to x square minus 3x we will get x square minus 3x the whole square okay so this equation will now become lambda upon 2 x is going from 0 to 5 x 4 x square minus i am going to square this bracket so it will be a minus b the whole square so a square that is x square square will be x raised to 4 minus 2 into 3 will be 6 x square into th x that will be x cube plus 9 x square into dx i am taking this negative sign inside so it will have it will be minus x raised to 4 it will be minus x raised to 4 plus x 6 x cube minus 9 x square so here it will be minus 9 x square so this is now our new equation 